Tottenham Transfer News, Alder World to Man United, Pochettino needs new centre-back. Mauricio Pochettino's men go into the hectic Christmas period third in the Premier League table after some stirring displays. After a 6-2 victory win away to Everton last Sunday at Goodison Park, Spurs are four points ahead of Chelsea and Arsenal and trail Manchester City by two. Last summer was dominated by the lack of transfers that Pochettino was able to make. In some ways, the North London outfit have surprised many considering they spend a single penny. Predict five results and win £25,000, free to play here meanwhile, the stadium move remains on hold as no official move-in date has been announced. Despite this, Pochettino's men have chalked up some big wins including the 3-0 victory away to Manchester United in September. The Champions League has also so far gone well for Spurs. Although it went down to the final group game, Spurs defied the odds and are through to the last 16 where they will face Borussia Dortmund. And there is a chance of silverware too as they take on Chelsea in the semi-finals of the Carabao Cup. What do Tottenham need in January? A centre-back would be handy especially if Toby Alderweireld leaves in January. Spurs looked susceptible at the back against Everton and defending has been a problem at other times in the campaign. Alderweireld has been frozen out by Pochettino. A move could happen for the Belgium international in January and a deal could happen, although United may have to fork out pound 40 million or more. Davinson Sanchez has impressed alongside Jan Vertonghen and has really matured. But if Alderweireld goes, Spurs will need a backup to Sanchez. A striker would also be helpful. Harry Kane has led the line superbly, but he looks like he needs a good stand-in. Fernando Llorente and before him, Vincent Janssen, failed to make an impact. Also, Mamsa Dembele is out of contract next summer so a midfielder would be handy too. Spurs were linked with Wilfried Zaha, but his asking price was steep with Crystal Palace demanding in excess of £70 million. Who do Tottenham need to get rid of January? Offloading Alderweireld would be helpful. While Vertonghen and Alderweireld formed a solid defensive partnership, Alderweireld appears to be far from happy at Spurs. Other than that, Pochettino has got the squad he wants and there is a good team spirit. Keeping the nucleus of players together will help drive Spurs on in the second half of the campaign. What will Tottenham actually try and do in January? Tottenham will try and bring in a centre back in January. While Juan Foyth has shown promise, but Mathij's de Ligt has been linked with a move to the Premier League. What Tottenham will actually get in January is very unlikely to see any new faces come through the door. While the squad needs tinkering, stadium costs, as previously mentioned, could prohibit any deals. Fans shouldn't expect too much. 